February the 8th, I think. I'm not exactly sure what today's date. The 9th. The 9th. Today's the 9th. So, yeah, I'm going to go get my hair done. Um, I need to get my roots done in a trim. But I can get to this appointment by 530. I hate being late. Hello, good morning. Um, I got my hair done yesterday when I came home. Um, I was hanging out with mom and then... I just went to sleep kind of early. I've been watching Blacklist, and that's what I've got up on my computer now. Um, I'm on season three. There's seven seasons. I've been watching this consistently for the past, like, few months. I've watched, like, an episode here, an episode there. Um, but I kind of stopped for a while, and now I'm getting back on it. Um, so, I think I'm going to watch an episode while I drink my coffee. Um, I love these mugs. They're from Anthropology. I don't know if they still have them, because over the summer, I bought, like, five of the mugs because they were they're originally $12 and they were on sale for $6 and then they had an additional 50% off so I got all these mugs for $3. So I would love to get, I don't know if they still have them, I would love to get like a whole collection of them and those be like the mugs I have in my house like later in life. So that's fun. But um, yeah, this is my office. I'm, if you watched my work from home, I'm sitting in the recliner facing the window. Yeah, it's kind of nice just sitting here in the mornings. It's a nice little view. It's supposed to rain all day today, but whatever. Um, I'm going to go eat lunch with the girls. I always say the girls. I have a few different group of the girls, but these girls are my college girls. All of my college friends, are. we all are in a different city now. All four of us live in four different cities. So we all kind of meet somewhere in Charlotte um, and eat or go shopping or something just to catch up. Uh, me and Sabrina both work from home. Jennifer um, works for a boutique. She does like their marketing and their Instagram, like really cool stuff. And then Natalie works for a plastic surgeon's office. So we all have like different stories and have lots of stuff going on. So um, especially Sabrina or especially Jennifer and Natalie, they have like a lot of stuff going on, but me and Sabrina are just sitting at home working so we try to meet up like once a month or like every two three weeks um the last time I met up with them we ate Mexican food which was really good so today we're gonna go to Barcelona wine bar in Charlotte so I am gonna go um finish this cup finish this episode and then do my makeup and I think I might stop by Ulta before I want to I like I'm in the mood to buy makeup like, I feel like girls know what I'm talking about. Like, you're just in the mood sometimes just to buy makeup. And I tried to go last night, and I went at 7.30, and they were closed. They closed at 7. So, I'm going to go again tonight. I need to paint my fingernails. Oh, can you see them? Well, I also need to paint my fingernails. Look how terrible. Mm, I never do my makeup this good, but makeup is done. I'm gonna do my hair. I would like to have false lashes on, but then I'm gonna paint these fingernails before I leave. And I have about an hour, so I think I can do all of that in an hour. <laughs> okay, now I'm in the car. Um, I'm gonna take a few selfies. I haven't posted on Instagram <laughs> in a while. Like, I posted, uh, I think the last post was just, like December, and we're in February. So, I don't know, I've just been, I don't really dress up ever. So I'm gonna take a selfie and then hopefully we can take some like full body shots today for Instagram. <laughs> uh, Jennifer, um, actually all the girls that I'm gonna, Jennifer, Natalie, they all take really good pictures. So I need to step it up. Um, Sabrina, but um, this is what I'm wearing. It's just a sweatshirt from H&M. This jacket, I love it. It's from Topshop. It's real dressy, but when you like wear like more relaxed things underneath it, it makes it look really good. And then my Spanx leggings and then my tennis shoes from Walmart. Um, I talked about the tennis shoes from Walmart in my fall haul. So I'm gonna take a few selfies and I'm gonna head, at Ul head to Ulta. Me and Natalie are gonna meet in about an hour and a half. So I'm leaving the house kind of early, but uh, I'm gonna go to Ulta, get makeup, maybe go get Starbucks, kind of uh, mess around until I meet up with her, so. I'm gonna take some selfies. You might see a selfie on Instagram sitting right here. So we'll, I don't know. <laughs> are selfies still a thing? Like are selfies still acceptable? I don't know. 
let me know. I just got back in the car. Um, I got a lot of stuff. Well, I got a good amount of things. I had a gift card too, but that covered some of it. I got, I kept seeing like, oh, I'd like to have that. Oh, I'd like to have that. Um, so I went ahead and got the Bedhead Masterpiece Extra Strong Hairspray. Um, finish on dry hair. Yeah, it's really, 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 really good. This is my favorite hairspray of all time. And it smells really good too. It le like leaves, it's not too strong of a smell, but I do get compliments on it when I have it on. People are like, oh, is that your perfume? I'm like, no, that's my hairspray. So it is a little pricey, but this will last you so long because you don't need a lot. So this will probably last me probably to midsummer, end of summer, something like that. Um, so just a little bit. So I got the Bedhead Masterpiece um, hairspray, and then I got the Living Proof Full Blast Dry Shampoo. Um, Living Proof, it's amazing. Uh, their dry shampoo is even more amazing. Um, it leaves a lot of texture. I have dry shampoo already, but this just really gives a lot of volume to your hair. So if you have like thinner hair or if your hair is like way down and you just want some volume at the top, this will be amazing. I think you should get it. So um, I normally don't spend this much on dry shampoo, but um, I had a gift card and also I was like, mm, I'm gonna treat myself with some dry shampoo. Um, and then I got some, let's see where that. So I got some lashes. These are the wispy lashes. These are pretty cute. I think it was $11 for five pair, which I thought was a pretty good deal. Um, so Meredith's wedding's coming up. Well, it's in a few months. I mean, it's actually not coming up, but I kind of want to wear, I kind of want to wear lashes more. I don't think I'll ever get eyelash extensions, but I kind of want to wear like lashes more. I think it really um, looks good. Um, so I'm going to try to get into these. I, I don't, I'm not good at putting them on. So hopefully I can work on that, but I got some lashes and I got some lash glue. I don't know if there's lash glue in here or not. It doesn't feel like there is. Um, it was like $5, $4 lash glue. Okay. And then I got, um, this is the Lash Paradise Mascara by L'Oreal. Love them. I get it in the blackest black. Uh, it's really good. I don't get the waterproof because the waterproof like doesn't come off your eyes. Like it doesn't come off your eyelashes. So I don't recommend that. Um, got that. Then I got a clear brow gel um, from Maybelline. Just something simple. Uh, I think this was like three or four dollars. Uh, they had tinted ones, but I just wanted clear because I don't really, I have pretty thick brows. I don't need to fill them in. I just want to keep them in place. So, and then I got the Maybelline concealer in the shade Coco. It's the darkest, it's like one of the darkest ones I had. I wanted to use it for cream contour. Um, I used to use NYX concealer for cream contour. And then when I ran out, I never got it again. I mean, I liked it, but I didn't love it. So, um, I got this for cream contour, just like a little bit there, a little bit there and a little bit on the forehead. I love a cream contoured look and I haven't done cream contour in a really long time. So that is all I got. And then I got a free gift. I got the living proof curl definer conditioning styler. A lot of wet hair root to tip. Dry as usual, scrunch, scrunch to form curls. Hmm. Uh, my hair doesn't scrunch that well, so I don't know if I'll use this. Like, I don't know if this will actually make my hair. I don't know. Might work. Um, so yeah, I got, I just stocked up on some stuff. I needed bronzer too, but I was just gonna wait and come back um, until like I actually run out of it. I don't wanna buy something I really don't need. But yeah, I think I'm going to be meeting Natalie here. Um, she's going to ride with me to Barcelona Wine Bar. Um, so yeah, so far it's been a good day. It's supposed to rain all day today too. I hope it like doesn't, but I think it will. As of right now, it's pretty sunny. So I'm so excited to see the girls. I'm really excited. Hello. Love the bag. I think I told you that last time. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I really like Hello, I'm doing a vlog. Oh, Hello. A weekend in my life. I'm a so mess. smell good. Thanks. It's like coconut. Really? Yeah. Oh, I haven't even put anything on yet. Okay. So now we're headed to the, the bar of the Barcelona wine bar.
Feel good. Put some spray on. Some spray spray. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. <laughs> We're going. We're light. <laughs> Taking pics for the gram. <laughs> We're on a rooftop in South End. Let me show y'all the view. This is really good. I think it's about to rain. So <laughs> hopefully we get some pics. Um, I got a few good ones. I'll post on the gram probably tomorrow. Um, but let me show y'all the view. It's like you can see like the main drag right here in South End. Let me show you. shopping yeah let's do it hey sab hi 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 <laughs> guess we're gonna go to the free people because we're free people we're, we're free, free people. <laughs> <laughs> wash my face that's why it looks a little red um and now we are gonna go uh, stream church service so we haven't gone to church in almost a year um towards the end of college uh, my friend Hannah introduced me to this really good church in Charlotte um called Forest Hill and I just was obsessed with it we would go it was like part of our routine we'd go to church eat lunch together like catch up it was such a good time it was such a great service and then COVID happened and so it just I went so, um, I've been streaming it through the TV. Oh, well, it's on my computer. And then I use the HDMI cord and stream it on the TV. Um, I'm, it's already started, but I can still see the service. They're just singing right now. So, um, we've been doing that for the past few months and it's really good. Um, so their Easter service was amazing last year. Um, the music's really good. So if you're needing a, um, church service to watch online. I'll put the link below. It's Forest Hill Church. They have several throughout the Charlotte area. I haven't gone in person to church yet, like I said, in a year. So we've been streaming it in the house. I've just been wearing, looking like this. <laughs> Feels like I'm seeing double. You're on my mind, deep in my Hello. <clears throat> so now we're in my room. It looks really messy, but I'm in the middle of going through my jewelry box and getting rid of all um, necklaces and stuff that I don't wear anymore. I have a ton of like chunky necklaces that I used to wear. Um, so I'm going through that and I'm about to take all the bedding off of my bed, all the sheets and wash them to get fresh. But, um, but um, I wanted to show you guys, I still look crazy. We just ate breakfast, but um, I wanted to show you guys what I got at Free People yesterday. So <clears throat> I never shop in the store. I always shop online for Free People. I just never, there's not one like super close to me, but I was in the area and I don't know if you guys have seen or like looked at their active wear but they have some of the cutest active wear ever it is pricey um but compared to like lululemon like lululemon is so pricey um and sometimes like nike things can be really pricey too so um it's i wouldn't say it's any cheaper but i think it's a lot cuter than like nike and some and even lululemon lululemon is just like very basic like their colors and cuts and stuff but good quality Anyways, I say all that because I think it's called Free People Active or Free People Movement Active. What is it called? I don't know what it's called, but their line of active wear is really cute. Um, and I got two pairs of like running shorts um, and they were $30 a piece, which really is not that bad at all. Um, I got a medium in the black. So they're like super high waisted. They go like way above your belly button. Um, so you could really wear like a sports bra and it would just show like a little bit of your stomach. Um, they're very high waisted, like 
this is the band. Like, that's a lot. Um, so, I got a medium in the black, and I got a small in this, like, orange color. I'm not sure what the... Papaya is the name of this color. I thought it looked super cute with like a tan and some white tennis shoes and like a white, um, like a longer sports bra. I thought that'd be super cute. So they're 30 bucks. Um, they're really popular. A lot of people on Instagram wear these or talk about these and they're sold out online a lot. Like they restock them constantly, but they're constantly going out of stock. So, um, I think these are awesome. Um, okay, guys, I'm editing this video, and I noticed I did not end the video. Um, after I tried on the shorts, I just, like, ended my day. I didn't do anything. So, um, it's now, like, a week later. I'm editing this video, and I'm going to post it today. So, um, I will end it here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Um, give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed today's video. But as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye.